I am dying. Take up your sword. My sword? I remember now. I was an archangel of the high heavens. I was the embodiment of justice. I was, I am, Tyriel. You have restored my mind, friend. And now I remember the warning I came to deliver. Belial and Asmodan, the last lords of hell, are unleashing a tide of darkness that will drown this world. Already, Belial's shadow has fallen upon Chaldeum. The priests of Rathma feared this would come to pass. We must move quickly. Let us return to Tristram and make ready. Time grows short, my friends. Even now, Belial's influence is spreading through Chaldeum. But how will we find him? We won't have to. Magda and her coven will lead us straight to him. I'm not going anywhere until Uncle Deckard's been laid to rest. There is time enough for that. I have called for a caravan to guide us to the east. Speak to the caravan master when you are ready to go. We will see to Cain as we depart. My friend, shall we depart to Chaldeum? forbids us from interfering with the mortal world. Yet you have done so, brazenly. All I am guilty of, Imperius, is bringing justice, while you hide, cowering behind your throne. Silence! You will now answer for your transgressions. Not judge me. I am justice itself. We were meant for more than this. To protect the innocent. But if our precious laws bind you all to inaction, then I will no longer stand as your brother.
I must leave Tristram behind. For a greater evil lurks within Chaldeum. The Lord of Lies is hiding there. Somewhere within the great city. Here we are. Chaldeum, Jewel of the East. Uncle Deckard loved this place. He wouldn't now that it is under the spell of Belial, Lord of Lies. I can smell his stench on the air. It would be best to split our forces. You two search for Belial. I shall hunt Magda. Are you guarding the refugees over there? I am not a guard. I am a Shira, commander of the Iron Wolves. We saved these refugees from Magda's coven, that even now wreaks havoc throughout the borderlands. Where did you last see her? She's heading toward Alcarnas, but has blocked the road behind her. However, there is another way. Through the Kasim outpost. This gate leads to Alcanus. You will need to follow the long road over the canyon bridge and through the Kasim outpost. Magda will pay for her wickedness. Take heed, traveler. Cultists guard these desert roads, and they will slay any who pass. I mean to stop them. Then you must not go alone. I shall accompany you. There are illusions out there. Mirages to some. But I can see them for what they are. The Coven's foul magic. They will lead you to your death. I understand. But my death does not lie here. She looks... different than anyone we have seen. Her skin is soft and smooth as polished ivory, and her eyes, they... Why are you two whispering like that? No, no reason. Stay back! Get in the box! very near to us. Where? You should never have come! Demons were face to your bones! I've missed killing these cultists, so come on then! You knew that would happen. I am an enchantress. The ways of magic and illusion are familiar to me. My name is Arena. Why have you come here? Well, I am also looking for someone. But here, let me clear the way for you. Captain, from behind! Protect the people! Iron Wolf! If not for you, the Lacuni would have eaten well this day. Are there more of them ahead? Even worse. Cultists are casting spells in two of their desert lairs to obscure the Black Canyon Bridge. Let us head north to the Howling Plateau. The cultist's magic seems to be emanating from there.
There is another illusion here. Cultists try to hide their footsteps. Their spells are weak and easily countered. If we follow these prints, we can find their lairs and halt the rituals. I will seek out any other traces of their magic. This is one of the cultist's lairs. They are casting part of the illusion inside. Another ritual at a cellar to the east of here. I owe you my life. Bless you. They... they tortured my poor husband. More hidden footprints. We were ambushed in the cave. Help the others. They're scattered in this cave. I'll help. I'm... I'm glad you came when you did. I won't fall to you, rotten feet. You thought I was dead. Thank you. Captain, there are too many! That's everyone. Let us report back to the captain. Everyone's accounted for. Or dead. All right, men. Finish patching up these two and let's get out of this damned pit. Yes, sir. Wait. Do you hear that? Another ambush!
Look, more hidden footprints. Imaginable. Look, more hidden footprints. This is one of the cultist's lairs. They are casting part of the illusion inside. to dispel the coven's magic. I'd lost all. I thought I was dead. Akerhat, bless you. It is with some reluctance that I write on the seven lords of hell, for they are the greatest of the demons, and even with... Tell me, what shall you do when Magda is dead? Kill the demon lord she serves. How curious. You must be the one I was meant to find here. Scream. Sure, we were crazed with starvation from three days with no food, but that is no excuse for what we have done. Day seven. I cannot face what I have become. Day 10. I hunger, but I am patient. Someone will come for me, and then I will feed again. I think it is time for you to know my true tale. I am not from Chaldeum. I learned these spells 1500 years ago. My sisters and I pledged our service to a man of great power. We called him the Prophet. He trained us and placed us in a magical slumber to awaken in this era. I am to prevent the Lords of Hell from invading. The Prophet? I have not heard of this figure, but your aid is welcome. I welcome the chance to travel with you. Now to the Kasim outpost. You will find it to the north, though it is still some distance away. Fine, Cook. 
corpse. Closer. The cultists are not using an illusion. The way is blocked. I must go through the Kasim outpost to the west. Help me! I don't want to die! Oh, thank you. They captured us to use as bait. Please, take anything you need from the cellar. We owe you everything. Belial, Lord of Lies, is the most elusive of the seven evils, and is a master of deceit. It is said that he manipulated Asmodan into revolt against the prime evils. This began the Burning Hell's civil war, which ended with the dark exile of the prime evils to our mortal realm. 